Andrew, why is Kelly so good at those uh, follow dunks? Well, um, he has great anticipation. You know, he's a good rebounder, great anticipation, and he's always active, you know, asserting himself and putting himself in the right position. So is that something, uh, you know, is that something like you, you feel like, hey, if you decided I'm going to go in there and I'm going to do it, you wouldn't be able to do it like him because he has a special skill? Or is it something that as long as you decide to do it, you can go ahead and, and make it happen? Man, Kelly got hops. You know, Kelly, he's he, he's great at what he does. You know, like I said, great anticipation, all that. Uh, me, you know, I do what I do. He, do, he does what he does. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. I mean, he kind of says you could do it too. Like, you know, he said, no, I, I, I can do it. I can do it. I feel like I, I have one. I could have put it back, but I, I came down with it, put it back up, you know. But he's a very, you know, energetic guy and very springy. So, Wardell, um, why is Kelly so good at put back ducks? Uh, freak athlete, but he's got a great eye for the timing of it. And, um, you no, know, you can jump that high and you're looking for those opportunities, then, you know, good things happen. So he makes it look really good though. I will say that it makes it look really good. Can we, um, expect, uh, you to get in on this a little bit? No, on the celebration or no, on yeah, the putback no, no, I mean, on my my boy's Fisher Price hoop at the at the house. That's about it. I don't know. You end every workout with a oop, so that's kind of like a putback dunk. If that counts, then yeah. <laughs> do those dunks do anything uh, for you guys when when Kelly like it's coming through and cocking it back like that in, in traffic? I mean, it's always just great energy. Um, it's weird now because the bench is so separated and everybody's in different spots. Like you celebrate and you look around, ain't nobody around you. <laughs> so like it's a, it's a different vibe than everybody shoulder to shoulder on the bench and everybody, you know, pushing on each other, having a good time. But we still enjoy it. And, it, and obviously in a game like tonight, it just keeps the momentum going. Uh, the one in Brooklyn was 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 great. It was the beginning of the season. We thought that was going to turn it up, turn up the volume for us, and then obviously it didn't happen. So just a matter of context. But for him, it means he's engaged and and uh, doing his thing. So that's always a good sign. Is he a springy? Where does he rank on the uh, like as far as bounce you play with? Is he up there? Oh, absolutely. Um, I don't know my power. I got to think about my power rankings. Of bounciest warrior I've played with. I don't know. That's a good Kiwi Gardner. Did he did that count? Who? Kiwi Gardner. Oh, Kiwi? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. I never I played with him. I ain't never played with him though. I played with him in Santa Cruz when I got uh sent down that day. But uh other than that, he's definitely he definitely would be up there. That might be a story you need to write, Marcus, about top five bounciest warriors since oh no nine. I'll put you top six. <laughs> All right, thank you everybody. Appreciate that. Tomorrow, no shoot around for back to back. No shoot around, seven o'clock start. Steve will be pre game at 5 15. And I got it right this time. Thank you.